Welcome back to the channel. Uh, this is another beautiful day, and I'm welcoming you back from a stable year. And I want us to discuss some things about what is going on in our country, Nigeria, especially. And I, uh, list, I read an article today that was like, I don't like what the headline or the full story is all about. And I would like to share my thoughts on this and I want to know your thoughts on this also. Uh, it's about uh, this aviation school, school, if you want to become a pilot because I'm an aviation enthusiast. Uh, I love aviation, I love aviation, and all my life is aviation. All my life, uh, to the extent that when I was uh, doing my industrial training attachment, I did it at the International Airport, and one thing about me is I love aircraft. I sleep in the airport, even when they said I should go home, I feel like I'm out. Let me stay. I'm not going home. That's how far I love aviation. But what I saw is I don't like it and I don't like it and I want people to share their thoughts on this. We put so many we voted people to be in power and to serve us, not to oppress us. Uh but the headline says Nigerian Aviation College not for the poor. I don't like that. That is, uh, they said it's from the representative, as a representative committee on finance. I don't know. Why would that, why would they say that? The government, are we saying that the government doesn't have anything, anything in stock for the poor masses? And if they want to vote, they come to us. And they are not telling us that the aviation school is not for the poor, it's, it's for only for the wealthy. That means if you are poor, you are not entitled to become a pilot. If you are poor, the government doesn't have anything for you. Scholarship based. I'm not in Nigeria, yes, but back where I am, uh, there is opportunity for everybody. Especially when you are uh the citizen when you are a citizen you have every opportunity that anyone else has even when uh if you are the president a uh, daughter you have the equal right to the same uh person on the street but unlike this headline that says aviation school is not for poor does it mean I want to become a pilot and I'm planning to become a pilot, but there is no way. Does it mean there is nothing that the government can do to help people, passionate people? I don't love the headline. You said the House of Representative Committee on Finance asked the management of the Nigerian Aviation College to jack up its fee from 7.5 million to at least 14 million naira per student. 40 million naira to become a pilot. And what baffles me down is, is it that they want to cut down the, uh, the, 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 the way how people enter into the school, admission stuff? Even the, uh, I learned that maybe they have 10, 12 maximum students in, 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 a, in, in a town, though the money is too exorbitant. But what the rep says, uh, what they concluded that it's not for the poor, I don't think it's the right thing. It should not be coming from them. We put them there to serve us, not to oppress us. I want to become a pilot, yes, I want to become a pilot, but though the money is too much, but that one doesn't mean that they'll be telling us that as far as you are poor, you cannot get that benefit of becoming a pilot. Um, why they want to jack and cut fee to 14 million is because uh, they said I've not verified the information, I just got it and I was like, Why all this? They said, Uh, this the aviation school in Lauren, their school fees is now 22 point something million. Why all that? Why all that? 
Is it that we don't they have the right resources to do it or what? Government cannot subsidize this. Why? Why can't government subsidize this for people to go? People with passion, people that can carry, they are ready to become a pilot or a jack top. I think we should look back at this and trace it back. I don't like the I don't like the, the news. I don't like the news at all. I like the news. That's why I'm doing this live video. I don't like the news. I think government should be doing something that will be beneficial to the poor masses, not only for the elite. They are not the only one. We have two hundred over two hundred million Nigerians. The larger percentage are the poor masses. And when you are castigating them and now like oppressing them is not for the poor. I don't think that is right. Uh, I don't want to talk more on this, but I think the 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 government should look into this. They should look into this. We have to help the country to grow, not that we will be shutting it down. Shutting it down. I don't know how Nigerians is going to look at the issue, but from my own opinion, I'm not happy with what I heard. I'm not happy. I never should say I should read it. It will take a longer time. That's why I did this video to just know your thoughts and it. know what you want it. Uh, what is your thought about the information? Do subscribe to the channel in the notification button. Smash the like button and comment below. Thanks. I don't like it at all. It should be everybody should have equal benefit in the country, everyone are less privileged. Not that you will be segregating, and that is what is not in the outside world over here. You and the poor, the poor and the rich live together. You cannot, it is very difficult to you know. If someone is wealthy or not. Thank you for watching. Do subscribe to the channel. That's my own thought about the, the whole scenario.